Assalamu alaikum and welcome to Muslim Playlist. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim, Alhamdulillahi Wahdahu wa Sallallahu wa Sallam ala man la nabiya ba'dahu wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in. I heard Brother Akhi Ayman a few moments ago speak about TikTok and something very funny happened. In Leeds, you know, I spoke to one of the elderly Pakistani uncles and I asked him, how are you? He said, TikTok. <laughs> I said, how are you? He said, TikTok. I said, you saw me on TikTok? He says, no, TikTok. I said, what do you mean? He said, TikTok. So I looked at him and I said, uncle, you're so old. Do you watch TikTok? He says, no, since I'm small, TikTok. I said, since you are small, meaning since he was little, he says, yes, TikTok. I said, I thought TikTok started a few years ago. He says, no, no, me, my father, generation. I got shocked. One brother told me, TikTok in Urdu means I'm okay, I'm fine. Everything is fine, right? Kaise ho, TikTok, right? May Allah Almighty bless us. So now if you don't know Urdu and someone asks you, how are you? You're going to say? No, you're going to say Alhamdulillah. Come on, guys. You're going to say Alhamdulillah. We May Allah Almighty grant us ease. May Allah Almighty bless you all. And may Allah Almighty bless the uncle and all the other uncles and aunts. The argument online today was whether or not a sister is allowed to wear a coat on her abaya. You heard that? We are addressing the matter of a sister starting off by wearing a coat to begin with because so many out there may not even be on that level. Where is the debate? Put on your abaya at least, my beloved sister. We will talk about that later on. At least you've got some clothing. Don't allow those who are chirping and talking online. They're not supposed to be looking at you in the first place. May Allah Almighty grant us ease. My sisters, what we need to realize, a lot of debates happening online and a lot is being said in order to discourage you from taking the steps to become closer to Allah. You know your level and everyone is on a different level. Make sure every day you do better than the previous I call. If you notice, I wore my abaya without a coat. <laughs> and I tell you, some people don't realize you need to put on a coat and you need to put it on. Subhanallah, where am I going to put it on? Wallahi, you know what? For as long as you know you're dressed decently and you're covered, and for as long as you know that you're not exposing anything by the will of Allah, do it for the sake of Allah and not for the sake of Abdullah. 